Hi everybody, Joe for Jaspi's Case Breaks.com with a box war. 2020 Panini Origins Football box war number one with a chance at the other half of this case. So we sold slash gave away eight spots, right? We gave away spots and filler breaks right there. So we're gonna do a half case break first, right? Open up all those boxes and whoever has the lowest number on the left side of the serial number, right? Only the left side number counts will win the second half. It's pretty awesome. You still have the eight of you, these folks right here, thank you. Danny and Ron bought spots straight up. Everyone else won their spot, so congrats. Each one of you are going to get a box from one side of this Origins. And then if you've got the lowest number on the left side, you can get yourself a second half of the case. So what's the strategy here? I guess you're hoping that your boxes are actually going to be bad, right? You don't want your your side to be good. So the next side hopefully will be fire, and that, and you win that second half, I guess. We'll ship the boxes to you sealed, by the way. And it's... um. We're, we're going to ship the box to you sealed, and uh, you can do whatever you want with it. You can rip them, you can sell them, whatever. Redemptions that are confirmed as a one of one, like when they have the parallel number on it, right, will be considered a one. Any other redemptions, obviously, we don't know, so it's we're not it's not going to count towards the uh, box war. Tiebreakers. If you have four out of twenty five and someone else has four out of one ninety nine, that's a tie. And then we'll do the second. Uh, the second lowest number will be the tiebreaker. We'll, you'll see how it works as we as we do this. First, let's pop open this fresh case of origins. Riffer says the quote unquote best strategy is to just get three one of ones in your own box. All right, fair enough. All right, then you'd get that box. You probably, I doubt there'd be four one of ones to beat that those tiebreakers, and then you win the other half. Empty box. So first of all, we're gonna pick the side right here. One side is gonna be for you, and one side is gonna be for the winner. I'm gonna use that die right there. We'll go one, two, three for the left side, four, five, six for the right side. So it's gonna be one. So this side is the one we're gonna do for you, and this side will be the one for whoever wins it. So we'll put those little slash marks right there so you know that this is the second side. We'll set that aside. And now let's number these boxes. One, two, three. That's a five. I guess you write it. There you go, seven and eight. And you can see one, two, three right there. And we're gonna go in numerical order on this, but we're gonna randomize names and teams. All right, so let's go back to the names right here. There are the box numbers right there, one through eight. Let's roll it, let's randomize it. Four and a five, five and a four, nine times for each list. One. And ninth and final time. After nine, we've got Ron down to Sean. Five and a four, nine times for the box numbers. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and ninth and final time. After nine, we've got two down to seven. All right, so Ron, you have box two, Aaron with box five, Adam with box six, Dustin with box four, Brian with box eight, Danny with the first box, Chris with box three, and Sean with box seven. So let's sort by column B. Looks like the people who bought their spots straight up have the first two boxes. So we're gonna keep track of the lowest number here Second lowest, and I, I, there could be a third. We may, may need another tiebreaker right there, which would be pretty crazy. 
I don't think anyone's gonna trade boxes, right? All right, and I'm gonna be updating this in real time. So let's, uh, so just view only right there. There we go. So I'm gonna drop that link into the chat so that'll send you to this spreadsheet so you can, you can watch as we go along. All right, I don't think there's gonna be any trades, right? So let's print this just so I can keep this on hand. And TWC, trade window closed. All right, good luck everybody. Yes, and TJ's right, we do have Origins uh, Pick Your Team 7. We get to have a fresh case of Origins Pick Your Teams in the store right now, so get into that action. We can get that, I'm sure we can get that first half done at some point tonight. Is everybody right here? So Danny with box one. There you go, good luck. And obviously you get everything in this box. Ooh, you got a book, Danny, right out of box one. You also have Tom Brady, 199 to 299. You got Dalvin Cook to 299. Max Crosby in the back right here. So right now your lowest number is 199. We got Antonio Gandy Golden. 89 is now your lowest number to 99. The autograph here, Darrington Evans, on card autograph. And the book is a 2020 Rookie Stars book. Blue team? Yeah, Michael Pittman Jr., 10 out of 25. Wow. And his teammate, Jonathan Taylor. Dual relic, dual auto. Woo! Two-color dual relic, dual on-card autographs of hopefully these future stars. Nice. Great first box. So right here, Danny is in the lead with number 10. Oh, actually, you might need more containers. I'll, I'll make do. All right, your next, just in case there's someone else has a 10, I think your next lowest number would be, would be 89. So I wanna keep track of that as well. Let me put this away. All right, box two is gonna be Ron Wester with box two. So Ron, you gotta, to, to tie, you gotta get 10 and then beat 89. Or you can get something lower than 10 and then you'd be in the lead. So meanwhile, Danny's gonna have to sweat through seven other boxes. So this is pretty exciting, all right. 
Let's rip this one open here. So even a base card, a numbered base card could, could be, so there's 108 to 175. Carson Wentz, Kenny G, 269 out of 299. We've got Devontae Parker. And behind Kirk Cousins is a Joshua Kelly relic. Wow. We're tied. 10 out of 10. All right. Well, let's let's log in 10 right here. And I don't think anything nothing beats 89 yet. 108 is currently the lowest number unless there's a number here. Another Darrington Evans. Wow. 1 out of 99. And there's Kirk Cousins. The RPA is Joe Burrow. 50 out of 99. Wow. All right. Well, apologies to Danny. But Ron, you've now taken the lead. And a Joey B RPA. What a box. All right. So let's flip back to this list right here. So with a tie at 10, now one is in the lead. The th just in case, the third lowest number is going to be the Joey B. Yeah, 50. So there's the tie, the tie. That breaks the tie. And here's the third lowest number, just in case. 50 out of 99. Wow. All right. So, <laughs> what an amazing box, right? So here now, to beat Ron, Chris, uh, the rest of you are you going to have to get have to have at least ten, tie it with one, and then beat fifty, which is possible. You got to get a 10, you got to get a 1, and then beat 50. But right now, Ron is in the lead. All right, sorry, Danny. Here's box three for Chris Erickson. Now remember, even base cards could, could, be, could, uh, could beat Ron at the moment. That's the crazy part of this. And there's still potential to get nice hits, too. All right, there's Josh Allen, 199 to 299. There's Carson Wentz, 50 out of 175. Behind McCaffrey is Saquon Barkley. Behind Christian McCaffrey is T. Higgins, 30 out of 199. There's LaMichael Pirine, on-card autograph. And there's Lynn Bowden Jr. Two-color silver and black patch and autograph. Uh, yeah, technically, one would be in the lowest numbered spot, then the tiebreaker would be 10, so on and so forth. But yeah, point is, Ron is still in the lead. <laughs> All right, and unfortunately, no numbers here for Chris Erickson, but some nice stuff in here. Thank you, Chris, for getting in.
All right, next box is going to be for Dustin. Dustin with box four. There's Haskins, 239 out of 2.99. Yeah, Ron's in a good position right now, but you never know, right? There's Stephon Gilmore with nine. That's a nine. There's Darius Leonard. Antonio Gibson, 78 out of 99. And we've got Gabriel Davis rookie autographs right on the card. Dustin looking for a number one here. Cam Akers not numbered jersey and autograph. You had the, if you got a, if you had a one, you had the nine to beat the tiebreaker. Would you have beat the third tiebreaker? Or no, you would have beat the 10, so you would have been good. But unfortunately, the cam maker's not numbered. See? That's how intense it could get, folks. All right. So let's mark this for Dustin. So once again, the one ties it, tiebreaker is 10, third tiebreaker. So if someone gets one and 10, they'd have to beat 50. If they get one and nine, it does, Riffer. It says explicitly in the item description that known one of one redemptions will count as one. All right, Aaron, good luck. This is box five. There's Kirk Cousins, 141 out of 175. 124 out of 299, Patrick Mahomes. TJ Watt, non-numbered base. And behind Melvin Gordon is Brian Edwards, 155 out of 199. The on-card autograph is another Gabriel Davis, not numbered. And the RPA is another Lindman. A couple duplicates in this side. Two-color silver and black patch and autograph not numbered. Sorry, Aaron. All right, but all of, all of this is still yours. And you won that spot too, so not too shabby. All right, Adam Copperman, you have the next box, box six. Again, you're looking for a one and you're looking for something lower than 10. If you get a 1 and a 10, you're looking for something lower than 50. And some nice hits. Maybe some nice hits in here, too. I mean, there's my guy right there. I'm a Raiders guy. Josh Jacobs, 145 to 175. Josh Jacobs. There's Daniel Jones, 63 out of 79. 
We got Kirk Cousins, another base card. Devontae Parker, not numbered. The relic is Jordan Love, 132 out of 199. The on-card auto should be right here. Yep. It's Devin Duvernay, rookie autograph for the Purple Birds. And Chase Claypool, not numbered, two color patch and autograph. Thanks, Adam, for giving that a shot. Congrats again on winning that spot, too. Saved yourself a little bit of money and got yourself a decent box here. I like Chase Claypool. All right, two more boxes to go. Ron Wester still sweating. This could all go sideways quickly for Ron, or will this be a glorious victory? I don't know. This is the exciting part. All right, box seven is for Sean A. Box seven right there. Good luck. And yeah, you got the Joey B too, even if you miss out on the, yeah. All right. Let's see what we got. All right. Is that a 10? No, it's a 70. Out of 175, Aaron Jones. 76 out of 99, Mitchell Trubisky. The base card back here, Juju Smith-Schuster. And Adam Thielen will show it, will hide the hits for us. There's Steve Largent and DK Metcalf. Eight out of 25. All Sean needs is a one to go to the lead. There's Cole Komet. Not numbered. And this could be a one out of three ninety nine, and that would that would that would put Sean in the lead. It's Anthony McFarland Jr. It's numbered. It's 22 out of 25. Oof. So the lowest number here, just an eight. All right. Ron, still in the lead. Got close, Sean. Got close. man standing in the way of Ron Wester and his eight boxes of origins is Brian Crouch. All right, Brian, congrats on winning the spot and good luck. Here we go. You need a one and you need something lower than 10. Tyreek Hill's not going to help you. 135 out of 299. Stephon Diggs, 58 out of 79. Behind Cooper Cup. That's Julio Jones. The relic is C.D. Lamb. Numbered 57 out of 75. All right, so you're gonna need a one 
and something lower than a one in the next two cards. AJ Dillon, are you numbered? You're not. There's AJ Dillon right there. So congrats to you, Ron. Nice AJ Dillon for you, Brian. On card autograph. We got to pick your team in the store too, folks. JaspiesCaseBreaks.com. And behind Cooper Cup, your final hit is going to be Devin DuVernay. Three out of 99. A low number, but unfortunately not low enough. But there it is. Three out of 99 for Brian Crouch. Congrats, Brian. Nice box. You still won that spot and still got a pretty solid box. So congrats to you. Thanks, everyone, for getting in. And, hey, congrats to, to Ron Wester. You had the lowest number, one, with a tiebreaker of 10. No one else got a one, so the tiebreaker did not come into play. Thanks for watching, everyone. Congrats again to Ron. You're going to get that, that stack of boxes that I marked with the slashes on there. So those will all be yours. They'll probably be shipped in a separate shipment from your hits. So just keep that in mind. You might get your origin stuff before you get the boxes. But let us know what you intend to do with it. Are you going to sell it? Are you going to, you can sell it if you want to. You can rip it yourself. It's all up to you. But congrats, they're yours now. I'm Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com. Thanks for getting on this box war. We might have some more of this in the future. So keep an eye out for it and get into it while you can. jazbeescasebreaks.com. I'm Joe. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.